So I realised that I basically submitted the wrong, the wrong police report. I didn't notice, I didn't even think about it. But then anyway, I sent us this letter, so I uploaded the correct police report straight away. Now, when I did that, didn't hear anything for days. And then on Sunday, this Sunday just gone, I got an email to say, we've received your police report. We've got your documents, we're reviewing them. We will get back to you again within 72 hours. Now the 72 hours is up, um, is up on Wednesday. So two days before we fly, tomorrow. It's up tomorrow. And bear in mind, Marley's going on Thursday. We, we, he has to be there between 8 a.m. and 12 p.m. Thursday morning. So we have to leave here first thing Thursday morning to take the dog. So we have been in a bit of a frenzy. I'm not going to lie. It's been harrowing. It's emotionally, it's really, really difficult because obviously we're doing this huge thing. We're moving across the world and to have this kind of hanging over us at the very last minute had i have known had i have known i would have done it i would have done it months ago i would have done it when at the very beginning but i didn't know like or if i did know and i've forgotten i don't know but i've not done it we all i was not expecting this at all had i have known and i don't feel like it's i don't feel like i saw it anywhere i did extensive research everywhere for um everything i did extensive and it didn't say anywhere yeah daddy's back look he's there i didn't i didn't see anything to say that this this could prevent us from flying like i feel like it should absolutely be written everywhere and i feel like i didn't see it in any of the videos either to say like it absolutely needs to be done in time oh, um so it is what it is. There's nothing really we can do about it. I mean, we, I have sent web forms off, these case-specific web forms. So if you, first a bit of advice, get your ETA. As soon as you're even thinking of going to Canada, it does last five years, I think, five years. Get it. Apply for it straight away. If they need any other documents, it will give you plenty of time. That is the one thing, had I have known, the ETA is it. Um, I've spoken to the IRCC, we've spoken to WestJet, um, who we're flying with, they said he can't board. Without that, he can't board that fly. So I've sent another, and then and then of all things, the, the website, IRCC website actually went down last night for maintenance because the website is absolutely shocking and it logs you out. Every time you log in, it logs you out. Every time you click a request, it logs you out. So the whole thing is just awful so yeah they've done some maintenance um i've managed to log back in this morning and i've, I've submitted another case specific web form um yeah so that is where we're at at the minute 